What's up, guys? Xavier here with you on the How Do You Do It podcast. <laughs> I'm out here with the legendary Kristen McAtee. Hello. He said it right. I've the hardest last name I've ever. been practicing. <laughs> I don't know why it is. It's so simple, yet so confusing. It's just not spelt how you're supposed to say it. Is yeah. that, that's the word phonetically? Is yeah. that the right word? I don't know. Um, so I get it. It's always wrong. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, I have, a, I have a weird first name, so it's like I, get, I, I know the pain. Yeah. Um, how are you? So you've just, you've just had a really crazy experience, the reality house. Yes. The first person I've spoken to about this, tell me what I only found out about this, guys. I don't know if anyone watching has been up to date with it. I only found out about it a couple of days ago and we're lucky enough <laughs> to get can. Kristen like really quickly. <laughs> what happened? Okay, um, so episode two. Yep. Um, we do a challenge and uh, you'll see what the challenge is. Pretty much three people are going home. This is like, it's not just a one thing. They were like, yo, we only have this many. Uh, bedrooms, three people got to go. There was 13. We only, we can only have 10 tonight. And we did the challenge. I got out. Uh, me, JC's dad, Omar, and, um, oh, Zach. Okay, Zach. Yeah. Those three people got out. And I was so bummed. I went into this thinking, I'm going to at least be here for half the time. Like, what the heck? And uh, I was super upset. And Chad was like, um, he's like, what, what did he say? He he was just like, somebody want to like switch with me, blah, blah. I was like, oh my gosh, I'll switch with you. Like, yeah. He's like, okay, um, but you got to pay for it. And I was like, um, how much? And at first, I think he said like 1500 or 1800 And he's like, no, 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 make it two. And I was like, 2000 And I'm, wa and I'm walking around and like all, all the girls wanted me to stay. Like they didn't want to see a girl go. And I, I, I sat, I called Scott, I got advice from him. I was walking around the house like, yo, what do I do? Like he's offering me 2000, and this could be an investment. Yeah. Cause, you know, like. And this is, so he, and you're able to do that. He's able to be like, actually I'll leave if you want to stay, but you just got to pay for me. Pay yeah, me yeah, yeah. So uh, they, they never said we couldn't. Gotcha, all right. So uh, about like, I feel like almost like an hour goes by of me just going back and forth. Is this worth 2000, whatever. And I came to the conclusion it was. I went into this, like I said, with the glass box challenge, this challenge, it put me out of my comfort zone. Lately, I've felt kind of stagnant. I felt like I wasn't doing anything out of my comfort zone. And that's when myself and I mean anybody grows the most. So I sat there and I was like, I'm going to do it. And I said, Chad, what is your Venmo? And I Venmoed that man $2,000 wow. and I switched spots with him. And I am so glad I did. I am not just saying that to make myself feel better. I'm actually really happy I yep. did. And because it was such an amazing experience. And like I said, I made friends and so much more goes on in the house that made it so much more worth it. And it, I wouldn't, I wouldn't change it for the world. But right. Chad was just like, hell yeah, I'll take it. Like, I'm going to go home and hang out with my girlfriend. I was like, okay, wow. thank so you. Wow, so he just, like, Chad just, like, was over it? Like, yep. just didn't have, even though he was he, still in? He had something to do the next day. And... So he was kind of like, well, I guess I can't, like, even if I did make it, I can't technically stay till the end anyway. Right. So it was kind of like, it a worked win -win. out for both of us. Yeah, right. And then afterwards he was like, I kind of feel bad taking your money. And I was like, no, I mean, you, you had the opportunity to stay for 25,000. Like you're a businessman, you know, you gotta, yeah. you gotta make money too. And, uh, he was super sweet about it. And afterwards he's all giving me words of encouragement. Like, you got this, you're going to win. This is for you and me. Da -da -da. Yeah. Like, so I'm really glad I did it, but yeah, that's that's the tea for tomorrow. All right, all right. Any yeah. other any other details about? Um, was there anyone that didn't? I mean, I saw some like crying. I saw a lot. Was yeah. there anyone that sort of clashed heads from the very start? Nothing. There there was no. I feel like there's no like crazy. Um, clashing of heads, if yeah. you will. <laughs> I couldn't think of another word. But I think. But once you see like the alliances roll out, it kind of got sticky because yep. some people make alliance with so and so and then they go over and make another alliance and now you're just kind of like dabbling in two different ponds and uh no, I I guess I don't want to give away everything, but yeah, that's all right. it gets it gets competitive. It's yeah. competition. Yep. So of course it, it gets competitive and I can't believe you did all of you shot they shot all of this in like a couple of days. Oh my god. And then so I went home that next day, mm -hmm. hurt ankle. Um are you allowed to say how you hurt your ankle? Um, running. Running, okay. I can say that. Yep. Okay. Um, so I went home on like the whole, you know, when, when, I, when I went home, whatever part I went home. And uh, I had VidCon the next day. Damn. So I went to VidCon, which is this wrapped up ankle, like gimping. Wow. But then I elevated and everything. It's good now. Perfect. We're good. 
Cool, that's all I need to go. Yay. <laughs> if you like what you saw, make sure you check out some of our other videos right here. And also be sure to subscribe to our channel right here for new videos coming out every week.